all right good morning guys um i wanted to make a video i've been wanting to make this video for a while but i wanted to make sure i gave you guys the right information first so i did call over to android as well as contact moto g or motorola the company and they actually are of absolutely no help so these settings will not be able to be achieved without adding a third party app so i'm just letting you know this video is going to be a third party app option um, i chose the best one easiest one to use and the cheapest um, it's free but i believe there is ads during the setup process and you cha um, share your data if you use the free version and the paid version is ten dollars a year which i don't think is half bad um, so let's get started so the thing is you want to change your quick drop um, notification bar, right? You don't want these black and large blue squares. So this is how you're going to do it. First things first is you're going to go to your um, app store and type in one shade custom notification. One shade. Okay, it should be the first one here that says one shade custom notification. And as we go down here, you can see uh, this contains ads in the purchase, um, custom quick settings, enjoy, safety. Down here it says that it collects data. So definitely read this over, but you can see that it got a lot of good reviews here. So that's the reason why I tried it. Once you install it, um, it's pretty straightforward. You open it. It says, do you want to start the free trial for 30 days and then $10 a month or try limited version? So I put limited version and there you see add right away so I skip it and I take it off it asks for accessibility on my phone and also notifications which are required to use the app so I put both those on it takes me to my actual So see how it gets full controls and I have to do notifications as well. Tells you where to click. It's so pretty self-explanatory, but I'm going over it with all of you guys so you can see the process and the ads if um, you want to find a different option. All right, I think I'm off of it, but you can see there's a lot of clicky things. And down here are the setting controls. You can see there's a lot of ads on the top, but down below it says you can change your layout, your color, but if you do absolutely nothing and click off the app now, when you pull down your drop down menu, as you can see your controls are back to normal. I mean, as normal as they're gonna get, right? So you can see everything on the top here, very easy. And that is pretty much uh the fix to the issue i'm sorry couldn't be better news and that you have like your data being shared but this was the only option if it's something you want to do otherwise you'll just have to keep using that super unconventional um quick drop menu that was part of the update all right thanks guys